Hey, good afternoon, good morning, good evening, whatever time you're watching this. Welcome to Our Garage Auto Detail. I'm Brent. If this is your first time landing on us, drop a comment below, say hey. If you like what you see, hit the thumbs up. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. But in the end, it's pretty much up to you. Do whatever you want. If you're anything like me, you're sitting on the couch, you're watching Real Housewives of New Jersey with the wife, and you're thinking to yourself, you know, if my truck is coated, how clean would it get with a touchless wash? If I just used my phone cannon, sprayed it down, you know, rinsed it off, did a pre-rinse, how clean would it get? Well, that's a great question. Today we're gonna find out that's exactly what we're gonna do. I do have my Aston Adams Ultra Foam Shampoo in a foam cannon with my pressure washer. We're gonna rinse everything down. We're gonna spray it with the foam cannon. We're gonna let it do its job. We're gonna rinse it off. Then we're gonna see how clean it actually gets without touching it. So let's preview how dirty it is first. In the last episode, I coated it with Underdog. As you can see now, no, no, other than have a great reflection, it's just dirty, right? Dirty, it needs a wash. I'm gonna do the tires separately. We are going to do the rubber, iron rubber rejuvenator by McKees 37. So yeah, it's dirty, but let's hope that the, the pre-rinse Man, still got that reflection, even, even with it being dirty. Okay, I'm going to set you guys up. I'm going to get started. You know the typical, you know, uh, time lapse or whatever. Okay. Okay, so I wanted to do the tires separately, use the actual McKees 37 tire and rubber rejuvenator. I wanted to do that separately. Now I'm ready to spray it down. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm dying. Oh, that was a close one. Now we're ready to spray it down, hook up the foam cannon, Foam it up, let it do the let it do its job. Guys, I want you to take a look at the hydrophobic properties, even when it's dirty. It looks kind of dead right there.
Okay, so I will say the coating probably makes it a little bit more difficult for the soap to stick. It does run off a little bit easier, but I guess we'll see what happens. I don't have a whole lot of faith in the uh, ability of to have like a touchless wash, right? I kind of feel like, you know, you have to touch it, unfortunately. So I'm gonna let this work for a couple more minutes. I might charge up my bucket. Even if the truck comes out sparkling, I'm still gonna wash mama's car. So, well, let's let it work for a little bit longer and then uh, we'll see what happens. Okay, let's take a look. I think everything's gonna end up being a little bit pasty. I don't know if I said that earlier in the video. I think it's just, it just needs to be touched. It, uh, I don't know, kind of like a hot stove or a cactus. It just needs to be touched. Let's look closer. I don't know if you can see it. But yeah, you can kind of see it. Look how pasty it is. All right. Let's see something. Let's get some of this. Yard in there. Okay, I wiped it with a mitt. Let's rinse it and see what happens. Let's take a look. Does it look like that haziness is gone? You can still see some haze there where I didn't wipe it. Look, as much as it would have been awesome to be able to wash with a, just a foam cannon and rinse and be done, that's not that easy, y'all. just doesn't work that way. So uh, I am going to finish the wash. At this point, it looks like the coating, you know, is looking good. It's the hydrophobic properties are fantastic at this point. I'm gonna wash it, get it clean, I might bring you back for the rinse process just to look to see how well it rinses off, but it's getting tight, so. Okay, final verdict. Uh, it came out looking great, but I had to use all my elbow grease. So, it wasn't, wasn't as good as I thought. Like, I mean, the final results are fantastic. They look great. I did find my first door ding. There we are. Look at my knuckle. Sad day, but shoot, it's been three and a half years. So yeah, final result is I like it, but just the foam, just the foam cannon didn't do what I wanted it to do. So, all right, guys, that's it for today. Take care of yourselves and each other. Stay tuned.